everyone just wanted to uh, make a quick video on how to use my profit loss spreadsheet for keeping track of your altcoins and Bitcoin so down here I have three spreadsheets available and US dollar the euro and the Chinese yuan and let's click on the USD spreadsheet since that's where I'm from and it'll open up and you will see that you cannot edit this page whatsoever and that's to prevent people from editing it or tampering it and messing with it basically so let's click on file and click on make a copy and you're going to name this whatever you want let's just uh, delete the copy of before and then click OK this is going to make your spreadsheet let's get rid of the old one And here, let's say that I have invested in, uh, let's say Archcoin. So we'll take that and copy all of that data. Then we'll go down to personal portfolio down here and paste all of that information in there. And let's. I also own some Bitcoin. So let's take all the Bitcoin and copy that. And then we're going to paste that in the personal portfolio. You could also keep track on this page. It does the same thing, but it's just it's a lot of coins, as you can see. And uh, I just like to keep everything consolidated on this page. And uh, let's say that I also invested in NXT. So we're going to copy all of that information also. Go down to personal portfolio and paste all that information there. And let's say Veracoin as well. So we're going to copy all of that. And you guessed it. Paste it on the personal portfolio. So here you're gonna, you're gonna see the per, per BTC price, and here is the availability of balance tracking via your wallet address. So you can see that for Archcoin and Veracoin, that is enabled. So let's take, these are just random addresses. Um, let's take this address from the for the Archcoin You'll see that's 14,837, and um, we're going to paste that in the wallet address cell here. And you'll see that pops up as the same amount there. And we're going to do the same for the Veracoin address that we have here. And we're going to paste that in the Veracoin wallet address. All right. And now, for the amount of BTC invested, let's say that I have 20 Bitcoin and I invest 0.8 in Archcoin. And I end up with the amount of 14,837. And for NXT, let's say I invested one Bitcoin for 40,000 NXT and um, for Veracoin let's say I invested three Bitcoin Ooh, that's a nice profit loss um, and for Bitcoin that'll remain that'll give us 15.2 um, Bitcoin left over and you'll see down here I have a total of 20 so now you'll see that I have um, all that split up. I have my total profit loss, and I've made this little little box up here. To, it's just to keep tabs and easily see what you've or your profit loss is. So my net total now is uh, twenty point six seven four zero one eight three two satoshi, and uh, so I profited six. 0.6740183232 Satoshi. And that gives me my net total of 
$620.07. Uh, if you have any other questions, feel free to contact me at my email or uh, contact me on Twitter. Uh, thanks again.